एवरी वन अ वेरी वॉर्म वेलकम टू ऑल द लर्नर्स एंड इन दिस मॉड्यूल आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दैट हाउ प्लेगरिज्म इज डिटेक्टेड बाय ओरकुंड सो दिस इज द वेब पेज ऑफ ओरकुंड सो ओरकुंड विच इज वन ऑफ द वेरी वाइडली यूज प्लेगरिज्म डिटेक्शन टूल सो यू कैन सी This is the web page of Urkun. So, how you have to detect plagiarism by using this tool? So, the very first thing which you have to do is you have to get an Urkun. urkun institutional id see as you can see you will get an institutional id from the urkun so if you are a faculty member so you will get an id by your name so as you can see this is my name and this is my urkun id and you can share this id to your students and they can upload or they can send the file to be checked for plagiarism by using this id so first step you have to activate this id so here is a link so as you can see this link so to use your personal inbox you first need to activate it via this link So you have to click on this link, and your Urkund ID will be activated. So before moving to the next step, what you have to do is you have to go through from the Urkund manual. So this is the user guide. So I will show you. So you can see quick start guide Urkund. Just go through from these three to four pages, I think. these are four pages just go through you will come to know everything all the instructions in detail okay so this is the instructions manual this is the login page of urkun you have to just enter your username and password and you have to click the login so by clicking the login just click so you will get this window so you will get this window and this is showing the previously uploaded files and their reports so what you have to do is you have to upload your document by clicking on upload document okay so uh, the next window which you will get that is submit document so first step here select analysis address or you have to enter below so you can select the analysis address by clicking on the urkund id which is provided by urkund okay so the subject you can enter you can enter any subject name for example Like check, I have entered. You can enter the file name which suits you. So you can uh, type some message if you want to give any message along with the report. Okay. So now you have to. What you have to do is you have to drag the file to be checked for plagiarism here. So, uh, example, you have to select a file. Just drag this file here. Okay. Okay. So this way, I have dragged the file to this window. Okay. So here you can drag the file, and 
you can the second option is to drop the file here so by clicking drop files so this way you can choose multiple files and multiple files can be uh, uploaded together so there is no problem in that okay so for example i have clicked this three file word file and click open so all these files are open to this window okay one more thing you can upload word document doc file ppt pdf and other formats also so this way the files to be checked for plagiarisms are here so you can so i am removing these files because it will take lot of time to check the plagiarism contents of these many files okay so i have kept only one file here and i have submitted the document so this is sending my document to the urkun so okay i will click okay here document sent okay fine okay so you will get an information in your email that the urkun had received the file so by clicking on refresh i'll get an email okay see urkun confirmation of report so you have got an email that your document is submitted so now again move you have to move to the dashboard so this is the dashboard so so it's showing here that you have uploaded your file okay so the plagiarism report will be flashed here like this so here the plagiarism report will be flashed so these are plagiarism report of previously submitted document and you will get an information in your email also you will get an email in your inbox that the submitted document has this much percentage of plagiarism and all okay so okay so we'll get an just you have to wait a little bit to get plagiarism report so you can track so all the details are here so i think uh, once more i'll click inbox okay it takes little bit of time and it depends the time of generation of report depends on how lengthy your submitted file is that means how many pages are there if the file is too lengthy it will take little more time and if it is one or two pages the plagiarism report is generated fast so it's taking too long so i'm showing you the plagiarism report of an another file so as you can see uh, this file and uh, it's 21% plagiarism so just open this file okay so and the file is opening so okay so this is a detailed report of plagiarism of uh, your submitted file so the color content as you can see the color content is showing the plagiarized content and and these are the sources of plagiarism 23% of plagiarism is showing and here from these sources uh you can exclude any source if it belongs to cc source creative commons source you can uh use that source because it belongs to creative commons source okay so you can exclude for example i'm showing you that i'm excluding this source and so as you can see the difference that the plagiarism is reduced to 3% so now the next step is you can export report in the form of 
PDF file. Plagiarism report. So this will show you like this. Orkun analysis result. Analyze document. The file name submitted. The time and date submitted by. Okay, and the significance that is the detail and the detailed report is here. So you have to submit this report along with the research paper or the reviewers or wherever it is being asked that you have to submit the plagiarism report so you can submit this report so dear learners it was all about using urkun for plagiarism detection you can explore other similar plagiarism detection software for your academic writing so stay tuned for more lessons and happy learning.